What's going on, y'all? Today I got some stock effect VSTs that all you guys should be using, man. If you're not using these, you should definitely start using these. It'll take your uh, take your your beat game to the next level, man. So I got this little beat I cooked up just to, you know for video purposes, make the video go faster. Got the plugins loaded up, man. So let's get into it. I'm gonna play the beat, let you guys see what it sounds like. melody i cooked up right there for the beat so let's get straight into it man first stock effect vst all these are the effects that you you know you put on your mixer to make your beat sound better affect your beat so first one i got for y'all is fruity reverb y'all should already know this one just kind of for the beginners y'all should already know this one man add reverb to your melodies you know depending on what you're going for some of your melodies add the reverb and you'll see the difference man let's check it out so this is without the reverb <laughs> much fuller that sound I like to change the size right here I like to mess with the size and the wet knob wet knob is to turn it up size is just to make the make the room you know of the reverb a little bit bigger or smaller a lot of times I make it bigger other thing I kind of mess with sometimes is the delay but let's see how this sounds so you can see the difference Definitely use reverb on your melodies. Uh, if you want to hear them sound fuller, use reverb, man. Fruity reverb, y'all know that one. Next one I got is Sound Goodizer. Now, Sound Goodizer I kind of see as like a saturation plugin, but it's gonna make it's also gonna it's gonna turn your melodies up and it's gonna give it. it I don't know, it's like an indescribable uh, sound that it gives your melodies, but I'll let you guys hear the difference on it. You you'll see what I mean. Let me let me uh, solo it for you. So this is without it. Start with A. Turn it on. That's with it. See how I just bring the melody to life? Then you got different A, B, C, D. Different sounds. This is C. Turn it up and down. Let's hear it with the beat. Let's turn it off. Y'all see the difference in that? I know y'all hear the difference in that. I know y'all see the difference without it. And with it. Always check your levels, make sure you're not clipping right here. Add that in the reverb. I know y'all hear the difference in that, man. So, yeah, sound good eyes, man. Check that one out. All these are stock VSTs. Another one right here, Fruity Filter. That's the next one. Let's check it out, Fruity Filter. Not a whole lot, but let's check them out. You can automate this. Simple filter. Party next door for a party. 
party next door got his name from. Fun fact. You got your got your effects over here. You can mess with. So definitely check that one out, man. A nice one you could easily just slap on your melodies, change the effect of it. Comes with FL. No need to go download anything besides FL Studio. Next one we got Fruity Love Filter. Let's check that one out. Also another filter. Let's go. Now this filter kind of does more crazy stuff to your melodies. It's, it's like more complex. So if you want to get like different effects, you know how sometimes you hear on like maybe future beats where the melody, you know, is doing all kind of stuff or like, you know, Metro, Southside uh, beats where, you know, sound real digital where it's not natural melody doing all kind of different things man this is this could help you kind of achieve that effect so Next one we got Fruity Chorus. Let's check. I kind of grouped these together. Fruity Chorus, Flanger, Phaser. Let's check them out. This may be solo. And these these work real good on like pianos, pianos, guitars. Give you melodies a different sound. I like that one. Okay, so that's Fruity Chords. Let's check out Fruity Fruity. I already hear the difference. Nice. Alright, all these effects are all right here. 
voor die vijver. Light down right there. Nice effect. See how that'll sound with the beat. Phaser, definitely check out those three man you can add them to your melodies like i say a lot of a lot of times they sound good on pianos um you know e-pianos too especially uh guitars you can add them to anything but i think those are the are the, like the three that they sound best on another one i got for y'all if you haven't been using it is fruity delay fruity delay three to be exact so let's check that one out on the melody <laughs> I always feel like uh, delay or echo is an easy way to get your melody to, to, to stand out and take a, a simple melody to like a more complex melody, make it sound more full, make the melody sound like you did more to it than you actually did. So, you mess with the delay time, wet and all. How good that sound? Let's mess with this key pitch. You got ping pong. And this comes with FL, y'all. Come on. No excuse. You don't even, you really don't have to go download anything third party. Look how good that Fruity Delay 3. I'll give y'all one more, man. Once again, this this bonus is just for the beginning. So, y'all already know this one. Y'all already know this one, too. So, where we at? Okay. Fruity Parametric EQ. All y'all should be using this at some point. You don't have to use it on every sound. But sometimes to EQ your melodies, you want to EQ like the... Uh, so, let's play the melodies. You might clash with your low end or something. So you may want to... EQ that out. See how the drums hit a little bit harder now. Definitely different ways you can use this on different sounds. Sometimes you might even want to get a little bit of the uh, high end out, depending on how harsh the melody sounds. Save save room for the artist's vocal, you know, because the vocal is gonna be like in this area. Definitely good with samples if you need to uh, EQ 
execute a lot of the high end out. See how much cleaner that sounds. definitely use uh parametric eq so like i say i already know that one that's for the beginners but yeah man that's all i got for y'all man so once you add all these you know definitely go check them out got the sound goodizer i mean you add all these uh effects to your arsenal use them at different times when they sound right man and and you'll be good so definitely check those out um if you made it this far in the video, like, comment, subscribe, man. Leave a comment. Let me know what videos y'all want me to do. Until next time, man. Signing out.